We're excited to announce a new feature for Clemmy. Uh, this is a swap feature. Um, so now, even those who don't have logins to Clemmy can request swaps with other members of the congregation. So this is how it goes. <coughs> Imagine you're on the page that shows your uh, upcoming responsibilities. You'll now see a little button here. Uh, if you hit swap, you'll end up uh, on a public service grid um, which shows uh, what your activities are that are coming up. And you can then choose uh, who you'd like to swap with. So uh, let's say you want to swap with Trulabon. Uh, you click on that. Swap request is sent. And then what's going to happen is you're going to get an email. OK, so here's the email. The email has been sent, uh, in this case, to Trula. You get a copy uh, asking that person to swap with you. It's a very clear layout. It says to them, look, you were due to do this. This is what uh, the other person was going to do. This is the proposed swap. And they can then accept or reject that swap. If you follow the accept swap uh, button, you come to a screen like this. Again, it, pre uh, it presents you with the same information. This is the current arrangement. This is the proposed uh, swap. So again, we're doing this now on behalf of the person that you requested the swap from. They then click accept and they get this screen. Uh, the swap has been confirmed. And now if we go back and look at the service grid and refresh it, the two names have been swapped over. And so there you go. Clemmy's new swap request feature.